Thank you for joining us for the KHSD Weekly Wrap Up. I'm Erin Briscoe Clark. Tis the season for giving back. Students and staff across the district have opened up their hearts to spread a little holiday cheer. With the turn of the key, Christmas arrived early at Plans Elementary School. <laughs> Ho, 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 ho. Santa and his helpers surprised students by delivering presents as part of the school's annual Adopt a Star program. Every holiday season, Stockdale students and staff adopt a younger student and purchase a gift off of their wish list. Students say it's these simple wishes many take for granted that really pull at their heartstrings. And it's just, some people ask for coats, some people ask for shirts, ask for clothing, and it's just very heartwarming when we can give a gift and they smile. <laughs> oh. In all, students made five stops and delivered over 300 gifts to students. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. An assembly line of KHSD police officers and department staff filled boxes of food for families in our district. We have turkeys, pumpkin pies, you name it, the traditional Christmas dinner is included. For the past several years, officers have organized the holiday food drive, collecting donations and donating themselves. School sites provided the department with the names of families who could benefit from the food. And once the vans are loaded, officers and staff head out to personally deliver the boxes to homes. We look forward to this every year. It's very exciting for us because these, you know, people become police officers so they can help people, and this is a great opportunity to do so. Yeah, somebody nominated him for receive a pink basket. The department delivered food to 55 families this year and hope to grow to even more families next year. Del Oro High School's Sun Shack team, along with staff members, hope to brighten the holidays for their families by providing meal boxes. The food was generously donated to the Sun Shack by the nonprofit organization Centro de Unidad Popular Benito Juarez. Around 300 boxes of food and fresh vegetables were distributed at the school to any family who wanted one. The team says school staff and the organization wanted to ensure that families were taken care of during this season. Good morning. Okay, so we're coming from Arvin High School from the Helping Plus Club. And we were talking to Santa, and Santa told us that you guys were behaving so well. Arvin High's Helping Paws Club spread out across the community to share a very special surprise. The club collected over 700 teddy bears, other stuffed animals, and toys for the annual teddy bear drive. The club delivered toys to students around Kern County at elementary schools, the homeless shelter, Ronald McDonald House, Memorial Hospital, and several other facilities. The Helping Paws Club says its goal is to double the number of toys collected next year to serve even more children in our communities. At North High School, the National Alliance Against Mental Illness Club, or NAMI for short, hosted a Christmas ornament decorating activity to honor lost loved ones. The club set up tables outside the cafeteria and invited all students to create their custom ornament. While it is touted as the happiest time of year, it's not always the case for everyone. That's why NAMI club organizers say it's important to come together for activities like this, share experiences, and feel supported. It gets them talking about it and recognizing what it is and how it presents for them. Um, it gives them a safe place to be able to talk about it and access resources. And then honoring a loved one or feeling that connection to them, that transition from a concrete to a more um, abstract object to internalize is a way of coping and dealing with loss. The Child Guidance Clinic was also in attendance to share important information and community resources with students. This community service project consisted of frosting, gumdrops, candy canes, and gingerbread. Liberty High School art students created gingerbread houses to sweeten up the season for children in our community. Students distributed the gingerbread houses to several local agencies, including the Ronald McDonald House, Hearts Connection, the Jameson Children's Center, and the Mission at Kern County.
family, you're listening to the beautiful sounds of the string quartet from the Foothill High School Orchestra playing holiday music in the front office for staff as they arrive for work. From our KHSD family to yours, we want to wish you a wonderful holiday season and winter break. We'll see you again in 2023.